Hello my friends, welcome back. It's your girl Andrea and I am on a journey to lose 100 pounds. Thank you for checking back in with me guys. Um, if you're new, please y'all share some love, subscribe to my channel um, and see what I'm up to on my journey to losing 100 pounds. For those of you who have been um, with me for a little bit, uh, you know that about two weeks ago, I started the Nicole Wilkins Body Transformation Challenge and things have been really um, going well. I actually um, have been completing all of my uh, exercises. Every uh, pink square on here is a day that I completed uh, the workout that she um, laid out for us. There's a lot of HIIT uh, workouts on here, which are strenuous and exhausting, um, as well as a bunch of lifting heavy objects, which I actually have been really, really enjoying. Actually, if you guys follow me um, on Instagram, um, at Andrea's Journey 100, there was a picture where I was flexing, and y'all, it's a baby muscle, but the muscle was there. Um, I was super excited to see like that little like line in my arm or whatever. It was really kind of cool. I was really proud of myself. Um, so I have been enjoying the program and every day that I get to highlight one of those, um, squares pink and do a little check mark off that I have completed it. Y'all, I just feel so incredibly accomplished. I feel so incredibly proud of myself. Um, and I know we're only two weeks in, I think the total program, um, it's like eight and a half weeks. Um, so yeah, we're just a tiny drop in the bucket, but I'm excited, um, for what I am doing there. So, um, also some other things, um, that I was hoping to accomplish, um, in January, uh, for a while there, my weight loss was not really happening. I was very much just maintaining and sorry, I'm looking for something, so I made three goals for myself for January to really help get the weight loss moving in the right direction again. Number one was 15,000 steps a day. Um, and I have had a few days where I missed that, but mostly I am on track for that. Um, before I was doing 11,000, I upped it to 15,000 because I am doing the uh, run the year challenge where you want to walk or run. 2021 miles. So I actually am about 150 miles into that and am excited about that. The other thing that, um, the second thing that I wanted to do in January to get my weight loss moving in the right direction, um, was no alcohol. <laughs> and today is, let's see here, January the 26th. And I have yet to have, um, any alcohol. So we are doing good on that as well. The third thing that I wanted to be doing this month was um, morning workouts, uh, preferably fasted workouts. Um, and that's so-so. I think that that is the area that I have the most room for development in. Um, I do want to make sure that I am getting seven hours of sleep. Um, however, I am just not pushing myself out of bed. I just am not. Um, so that is something that in this coming week I really want to work on getting up earlier, getting that workout done, just so it's not like hanging over my head and just kind of like stressing me out for the rest of the day. Like, when is that workout going to happen? Um, am I going to be too tired? You know, are the kids going to be needing things? Is my husband going to be irritated that I went to take this time to work out? Whatever it is, right? I just want to be able to just check that off real early in the morning. Like, it's done. I don't even have to worry about it anymore. So, that's what's going on so far. Um, let's talk about my weigh-in. Um, so last week, um, I weighed in at 188.4. And this week, I weighed in at 186.8. So that is down 1.6 pounds. Incredible loss. I'm excited. I'm super pleased with myself. Um, I'm really hoping that that will um, continue. Um, as you all know, I do have a goal of losing the last remaining 40 pounds of my 100 pound weight loss, um, by my birthday in June. And when I tracked that out, um, this week I actually should have been at, um, 186.1. So I am 0.7 pounds above where I need to be. Um, two pound weight loss is a pretty 
significant weight loss per week. Typically, it is not anywhere close to what I usually uh, lose in one week. So um, some things to kind of think about, um, as well as, you know, as I'm getting smaller, if you think about that 1.6 uh, pound weight loss and the percentage of my body that that is that I'm losing in a week, it's a lot bigger than when I was like 250 pounds and losing like a pound and a half a week. So um, that's also something for me to consider. Um, like I said, I'm going to try and work on those morning workouts, doing fasted workouts and see um, how that might uh, affect the results for next week. Um, but overall, I am pretty pleased. Um, I'm very excited. That brings my um, total down to almost um, 64 pounds lost. Like I said, another 36 pounds to go by my birthday in June of this year. And um, I'm just going to keep on keeping on. So guys, please remember to subscribe uh, to my channel. Go ahead and give this video a big thumbs up and give me some, uh, cheer me on down in the comments and let me know how I can support you in your very own weight loss journey. All right. Okay, guys, thanks for checking in. We'll see you next time on the journey. Bye.